Hi, I am Lacey Samira, and I'm going to show you how to refresh your Jamacure after it's been on for a little while. Now, this is the Home Jam, and it is one of the mats, and it has been on about 10 days. So, I want it to make go a little bit longer before I replace it out. Normally, I would just go ahead and, and replace it, but I think this one's doing really well. It's actually on over um, a lacquer. Um, but I want to make sure that it goes a couple more days. So the way I can get a little bit more life out of my Jamacure is by first, I will press my cuticles back. I haven't done that since I applied them. Just to make sure they're nice and out of the way. Then I will take a crystal file and buff over at a 45 degree angle over the ends to pull off anything because I've got some ragged edges there. Go ahead and, and kind of smooth those down. I didn't do a very good application on this one. You can see I got a wrinkle in there. Um, these matte wraps are really thin, but I feel like they get an even better seal, so they do last a little longer. So once I've got a nice smooth edge, I'll do the baggie method. I take a Ziploc baggie, wrap it around the end really tight, and I wrap it around the cuticle really tight too, or the back of the jam. I'll put it in front of my mini heater. Get a nice tight seal, then I'll pull that off. And then just for good measure, I'll take a, just a plain old tweezer and get it hot in front of my mini heater. And I find that the place I have lifting issues the worst is the back of the jams. So I wanna just apply a little heat and pressure to the back. And it's nice and smooth. Looks like it's not gonna catch on anything. So go ahead and apply my cuticle oil to keep my fingernails healthy. And then I'll go ahead and do that to the other nails, and this Jamacure will last me a lot longer. Thank you for watching, and be sure to check me out at samira.jamberrynails.com. Thank you!